Okay, today is going to be our first little tutorial in AutoCAD. So what we're going to open is we're going to open AutoCAD 2010 English Edition. Do not open something called AutoCAD Architecture or anything. Open the one just called AutoCAD 2010. I already have my license, so this will always pop up. Just close that, and it'll start to open. When we were in class the other day, there's a new version called the Ribbon, and I'll always close this down here too, this borrowed license. There's a new version called the Ribbon. We're not going to work in the Ribbon the first semester. We're going to work in the Classic view. So go down to the bottom right-hand corner, click off 2D Annotation, and click on AutoCAD Classic. This is the version we're going to work in this year. And then when I get into AutoCAD Classic, there's a couple things I want to close. I want to close off this tool palette. And, oops, and also close off that little toolbar there. Uh, the way you borrowed your license was you went to the command line, typed in borrow license, and hit enter. I already have a, a, a borrowed license, so I can't get back to that. When you're ready to return it, it's only a six-month uh, um, borrowing time, I guess. You type in return license. And you can return the borrowed license. I will return it. I can't return it because I'm not online. Um, I'm going to keep it until March 23rd. That's how you return your license. So return it maybe a week or two weeks before before um, your your license expires, and then just borrow it again. So make sure it doesn't expire on you. Uh, what we learned last time was we typed in units. You go back down to the command prompt there. Whenever you need to type something, go down to the command prompt in the bottom left. I'm going to type in units. And we're going to be doing stuff in architectural and doing everything in imperial. So I'm going to change the length, the type to architectural, the precision to 1, 256. We'll crank that up. And the insertion scale, instead of millimeters, move that to inches. The angle, we can also put that at a couple decimal points or four, whatever you want, doesn't really matter. And then hit OK. The other thing I want to do today is uh, I want to teach you how to save. So we're just going to do a save as. And I want you to save everything into somewhere in your D directory. So there's my D directory here. I'm going to. This is my 0910 for semester, 215, and I'm going to save it. I've already saved one with you guys last class. I'm going to resave it and kind of call it Shaw House. Today's date is the 28th. So I'm going to save this one as the 28th. Oops. Shaw House 28th. Now I have two drawings there. That's all we're going to focus on today. Good luck, and we'll, we'll learn more a lot more next class.